a special atmosphere and a grand occasion. One the players and fans alike have been anticipating in the tension-laden days leading up to this fixture. But now the talking has to stop and the football must take over. Who's going to emerge victorious? It's a hard question to answer. It's Crystal Palace. They face Manchester City and it's live right here on EA TV. Hello everyone and delighted to be able to report that the weather has cooperated tonight here in South London. We're at Selhurst Park. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary and alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Crystal Palace facing Manchester City. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Well, key to their success today will be the front three. If they combine well, are clever around the box and rotate their positions, they'll cause all sorts of problems. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. A City corner it is. Can someone get on the end of this? Emphasis on the clearance, a good one. Well, playing away from home hasn't been a problem at all for Manchester City. The wreck will not lead to the goal that puts them ahead. Splendid defending. Who's going to get on the end of it? And a bit short with the clearance. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Well, that shouldn't really happen from a throw in. Ezzy. And they've given back possession easily. Joel Ward Munoz on to Anderson Jefferson Lerma now with Lerma oh good vision is this the moment and woodwork rather than net on that occasion, Stuart. Well, you can see the relief from the keeper. He thought that was going in. I certainly did. Silva. Holland. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Who can he pick out? Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. Jean-Philippe Mateta. Well, that is how to play advantage. Mitchell. Now with Lerma. Ayu. This is looking threatening. And a very good challenge. De Bruyne. And Crystal Palace moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? 
Now disappointing end to the move. Stones. Diesch. Gvardiol. On to Silva. Promising possession, this. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Just watch this again. Bernardo Silva's pass is inch perfect, and what a finish from Haaland. It gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. So Palace get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Now can they come up with a quick response? Ayu. Richards. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Good weight on that pass. And a decent save, full credit. Richards. Are you? Just the challenge that was required. De Bruyne, on to Holland. Rodri, that is how to keep it out of the net. Foden. Rodri, De Bruyne now. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Richards. Are you? He has time to play it over. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Big chance to get them on terms. Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflex from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. Well, there's the confirmation. That was nowhere near to crossing the line, was it? Another short corner here. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Good use of advantage there. Ayu, the danger not over. And he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. And the referee blows the whistle. It's half-time here. Typical Manchester City, you might say. Best away record in the league. It's going according to plan for them. Well, once again, away from home, they've been very good. And it all starts with a positive attitude. Right from the start, they looked to take control of possession and dictated the flow of the match. It's going to make for an interesting second half. Well, advantage City after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. Rodri. Hold on! And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal.
so underway again and a 2-0 advantage here Joel Ward Jefferson Lerma on to Anderson Chris Richards now with Lerma Jefferson Lerma moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass chance to make a game of it here and fine goalkeeping well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Short corner taken. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. And over comes the corner. And a relatively high degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Erling Haaland. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Skipping away. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Kevin De Bruyne room to roam for City on the wing what a genuine opportunity but it was squandered goal kick here it is now a substitution Joel Ward. Ezzy. Here's Anderson. And a free kick awarded by the referee. And a confident clearance. Rodri. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Will he play it in? And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Need to get back quickly here. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Now, referring to the earlier infringement, the referee sees it as a bookable offence. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Thank you.
Let's see about the delivery and clearing his lines. Now the attack fizzled out. Joel Ward. Uehi. Jefferson Lerma. Palace now in potentially a dangerous position. Being egged on by the crowd. And lining it up. Oh, great defending. Breaking at pace. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Just ten minutes remaining here. Well, the ball goes out of play for what will be a goal kick. A change on the offing for City. Rodri Walker now Stones That's a good looking ball and nearly the ideal ball but a good piece of defending and support available Played into the box making sure nothing came of it Pressure applied can they make something of it Timely intervention. Schloop. Really good build up, but no end product. Well, the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Ezzy. Now, oh, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Foden. Options in the centre. Rodri. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. And they need to get tighter here. Oh, good skill, and he's managed to beat his man. Can he get one back? He can! And who's to say there's not enough time for them to level matters? It would be quite the story. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, just when everything was going Pep's way, he now has to get his team refocused and back on track. And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel-good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win.